Christy here from Adeline Country Cottage. Um, I'm going to show you another flip through of two more journals today. And without further ado, we'll just get straight into it. Okay, once again with the tie off uh, the linen, um, dyed with uh, rose petals. Um, this is the creamery and a beautiful front cover again with the uh, washi tape down the side. And that's the back. There's lots of stitching around the edges and moving into the side. So I've got a lov lovely image out of the, um, the magazine. And of course, once again with the pocket and the tag, a bit of stamping, some fabric, stitching and a beautiful image from the magazine. Um, Flipping it over, you could cover that up with some images or, you know, perhaps some um, another piece of blank paper and do some writing. little tuck here and a tuck over here. Uh, a bit of designer paper, which is really cute. Um, well, I wouldn't say it's designer paper. It was an image of a, a rug that I had um, that I, I pr printed off. I just thought it was absolutely gorgeous. Uh, so a bit of staple with uh, some lace. Um, so another image here which can be flipped over if you like, um, depending on what um, mood you're in, I guess. Um, some vintage fabric up the side, tea dyed paper, vintage type typing um, typewriter paper, which is out of the green one that I have. Uh, we have some dyed lace here with a little pocket. Once again, another little handmade tag that I've made uh, just with some layering, some lace, an image from the magazine um, that can be used for, you know, writing or on the back and putting it on somebody's gift. Uh, there's a postcard, old postcard, which I've printed. Um... I find it very hard to give away my postcards because I collect them. One day I'll show you my whole collection. Um, they're pretty fabulous actually. And on the back, it's just a beautiful best wishes, cute little image of a cart with some children. Um, some designer paper here. Uh, I think that one's from uh, Kaiser Craft actually. And some ephemera, layering of lace linen um, and some muslin little crown tag uh, it's the back of the designer paper another piece of or image rather of out of the magazine uh, which is quite cute and music paper vintage music paper again another image out of the magazine um, it's really beautiful I'm actually after one of these um, bottle dryers they're beautiful and of course you know you could stick that down um just the writing on the back of that one um some grad uh, grid paper vintage ledger paper once again the porter paint swatches um thought it was fitting in this mag uh, this particular journal Beautiful image out of the magazine, yet again. Uh, some typo text out of the vintage typo text book. Uh, tea dyed paper on the on the uh, the flip side. I've actually printed off uh, some music paper front cover on there. Um, a little. This is the center of the page. Uh, this is a envelope that I've cut in half. Um, just a little place where you can slot some, you know, ephemera inside that, uh, or anything really, uh, that, uh, creates your mood journal that you find in your travels. And again, the other side of that text, ephemera, another image can be flipped over if you wish. It's a beautiful image there. Another image, I've just stuck that down. And so the other side, the music paper, the, the image, the 
little pocket here, the other side of the pocket with some ephemera inside, another flip out with, again, the, the scripted um, text on there. Another one of those images, uh, again, from the manual, uh, typewriter manual. Um, this isn't vintage, however, I thought the colouring is perfect for this journal. Um, it's um, on a linen, linen, uh, yeah, it's printed on linen. And I've just laid a bit of uh, lace over the top. Um, ephemera, another rusty clip. And a back page of that beautiful rug again. Another little uh, flip where you can journal underneath. Again, some more of those beautiful images. And again, uh, the tag, fabric with a place where you can journal in the back, bit of layering, and of course, my little logo here. And that's that one. And then we're going into this one. Same tie off. Stitching around the edges. The silk washi. Uh, another pocket. Some fabric. Gathered fabric here. Another one of those tags that I've made with um, just some layering and a beautiful image from the magazine. And another image from that magazine again that is just really gorgeous. I really love that image. It's beautiful. And a little tuck here. And of course over this side. What's happening now? I'll just pull that one out. Um, Oh, gosh, I'm all fumbly today. Okay, so this is another designer paper. Um, I've had this for a long time, pressed metal. I, I can't remember where I actually got that from. Um, Porter paint. I thought these are beautiful, kind of remind, uh, looks like grapes. Goes with this image here. It's just beautiful. And, of course, you can flip that one over. Tea dyed paper. Sorry, it's getting really dark in here. I think the it's going to pour down with rain soon. Some vintage fabric on the side. Again, the typewriter paper. Another little pocket where I've added some trimming. A tag. Another postcard. Some more layering happening here. Um, spring comes rainfall. Uh, is printed on the little tag here and some ephemera oh gosh it's getting really dark uh, another image from the magazine and of course the music paper another image stuck on the grid paper and I've actually added a little bit of the image on here I didn't want to throw it out I thought it was still too pretty a uh, ledger paper a little pocket Ticks, more journaling space, and of course a printout from the front cover of a music um, book. And there's some more images here tucked in, this the centre of the page, the text page, and ephemera. More images from the magazine, pocket with some washi, another journaling little spot. Beautiful writing, image stuck, a bit of a tag hanging here, a music paper, and this is the designer paper on this side, the other side of that pocket, some layering, ephemera, flip out, of course that scripted writing again, and a little tab here. So, um, some more images from the magazine. The typewriter paper with a little tab, tea bag tab, so a, fl a, a tip in, fabric tip in with some layering. I think I missed the page in the other book on that one actually. Oh no, I didn't. No, 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 no. What am I doing? Okay, some more ephemera. That vintage clip. Another little place to journal. 
again a beautiful image from the magazine and I absolutely love this particular um, layout love the coloring it's just really beautiful this fabric is stunning it's got some layering little place to journal um, I didn't stick this one all the way down um, tag and of course oops let's get that back in there the pocket and of course my logo down the down the bottom okay so that is the inside of these two journals they will be listed soon on the website mm -hmm. here we go fumble fingers here um yeah they'll be listed on the on the website and i uh, hope you enjoyed the flip through of these two and uh, would love for you to subscribe and comment um, to let me know what you think of these and I will see you in my next video. Okay then, bye for now.